Welcome to Firewalls.com. My name is Brian Reed, and this video is the second in a series covering the application intelligence that is found in the new generation firewall that's out. If you recall in our first video, we showed you that by simply creating a firewall policy to allow users to browse the internet, they can do much more than just browse websites. They can run music applications, they can access instant messengers, and so on. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can use this intelligence to actually create policies that will block access to those applications running over the standard port HTTP or HTTPS. So let's go ahead and do our example here. I'm going to go to one of our desktops and I'm going to open up the browser. As you can see, we're going to an HTTP website. Uh, this, in this case, it's Pandora Radio. And now you can see the application's up and running and we have music playing as well. So let's go ahead and close that and if we go back to our sonic wall in this case we'll pull up our list of applications and you can see we have Pandora radio that it identified. So if we simply select that application say create a rule to block it and hit create rule then we're done. So if we go back to our desktop and fire up the Pandora radio it should be blocked and there you go. In this case, the SonicWall identified the actual Pandora application running through our HTTP port and blocked the user from accessing it. Okay, in our next video, we're going to cover how you can allow certain applications to go through the HTTP port, but actually control the amount of bandwidth that those users can use. Okay, if you have any questions or comments, please enter them in the section below, and have a great day.